this is the end of my nesting project. So here's how it ended up being. And we're going to put all of it together, I'm hoping. Anyway, so let's go into my friend, sister friend. She's my sister friend. She liked this one that I made. There's nothing I can really do for it. I could probably put it in there. So we're going to hide that in there. I made her a bookmark along with some of the little different um, doodahs. And then I left her pages that she can do. And then this is going to go... And she's already seen this, so it's not a big surprise. So then this is going to go this way. Okay, so that's done there. So now well, we got to put it in our box. Which actually, um, not thinking that's gonna work. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe it'll work. Maybe, maybe it'll work if I do it that way. I think so. This has to go up here first. We struggle. We struggle with these things, do we not? Yes, we do. mishap here with our I don't know what happened that's what happens sometimes things happen okay so I'm wondering if I'm gonna have to tape that no I guess it works there it goes so we've got the surprise in the book and the book in the box and now the book is going in the bag I'm gonna find the bag oh there it is And the nesting project is done. Ta-da! Um, there's a lot of things in that I would change. I might try it again and make some other bags. Um, out of different material. But I wanted to know if this stuff could be recycled. I mean, it can. It's, you know, and I, I made recycling out of the little other parts. Okay. So it's the end of that one. Hooray, we're done with the things. And I had bought her stickers but she ended up wanting to put the stickers someplace else so we didn't put the stickers on this um all right so i did this little pretty stuff here i don't know that you see it all i did some thing i glued up some more of it to she likes butterflies so we did that and then we put a little bit of bling on here which i don't like the word bling but that's okay i get it so put some there and it's all done She's seen pieces and parts of it since, you know, we live in the same house. It's a little hard to hide from it. Oh, look. Oh, look. Okay. So, all right. Okay. So, Al John made this Rolodex file holder out of a book. I really liked it, but it's pretty simple. So, it didn't need to really show you guys how to do it. Um, it's so you can put stuff in it, you know, lists or whatever. I am. Um, I'm putting in pockets. I'm going to put my pockets in here eventually. Um, she used the back end of the thing to make an accordion file. I didn't do so well on my accordion file, but that's okay. Um, then before I knew it, I had already folded out the front part of this, so I decided to put one of my pins. This is black paper I bought so that I could check out these pins my daughter got that are metallic, and then I can put stuff in there too. Um, it can sit this way. And it can sit this way, which this way probably works for me. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet, probably over there. But I wanted to do, she decorated it, you know, the white spots, some of the white spots with stuff. So I'm going to, this is one of the things I'm going to use my um, stamps, uh, pads, and see how they turned out if they, you know, are still holding up well or not. So that's what we're going to do next is stamp pads with stamping with various stamping, so um, let's get some of our stamps out.
I got new stamps, so we're going to do those. It's really noisy. So I have to put these here. Um, and then, then I have other stamps in there that we'll use. Stamping ink pads that we we'll use too. Okay, so here's the blue one. I used this a while back, just recently. So it's kind of wet because it had dried out, which I think is the issue here is that it dries out. So, um, let's get a stamp, a stamp, a stamp. I had used it on this. I was making mine, so that's what I used it on. I just did a whole bunch of stamps. Oh, here they are. I just, I just got a stamps. The one to check out. I just bought some at the thrift store. I wanted to see how they turned out. How they are. Okay, so let's see what we get. This is our glue. It's very wet. There's not going to be any rhyme or reason to this. I don't even know if you guys can see that. Let me, let me, let me see. Oh, you can just barely see it. Oh, see, that worked pretty well. Okay, so the blue, but I had, like I said, I had to refresh it. Um, nobody's going to like the fact that I... Yeah, that's a six. Or could it be a nine? Let's do it this way. Nine. Why are you doing numbers? Just because I want to see if my numbers worked. Kind of want, it's a one-shot deal, huh? I wonder why. Put that there. Mm. Yeah, kind of a one shot deal there. Okay, then I got these ones here. I wanted to see how these work. These are spongies. We got we gotta change colors up though, so it's very wet. I, I'm noticing. P, nope, P, nope, P, nope, no P. Okay. It's not only just the stamps, I think it's it's the pads and the stamps and the colors and the, I don't know. So, and see, I don't blame the DIY thing. I blame myself because, you know, we did this different than we are supposed to. The, the one that was made with the dish pad didn't stay didn't um, work well. Okay, this is red. There's not much red there. Let's see. That's a little red. Let's flip it over and see what happens. Maybe it's more on this side. These are the mattress tops that I used. The black and the red are the mattress tops. So that works all right. It's it is definitely a red. It's not a, a a vibrant, vibrant, vibrant red, but it is there. More than the black is, really. Okay, so 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 far it's black and red. I got black and red. That's what I got. Black. This is another one. Okay. That's one. That's not one. Okay, so that one worked. The red worked. It's it's not a lot of color on there though. There's not a lot of color. Alright, now we're down to these ones here, which I really need smaller smaller uh, things. We're gonna have to just do it this way. My homemade dabbers that don't want to work. Got nothing there. Nothing there. It says there's something there, but I don't see nothing. So it's there, but it's so light, so light, so light. So this one dried up. That's the blue or purple. Okay, that one dried up.
I'll just have to do these again. Let's see if I can get them to work right. Okay, so this is a. I don't know what color this is. But what color it was is not there anymore. Looks like a red. I think it's a pink, if I remember right. Yeah, there's nothing there either. I wonder if I do it this way. Pretty dry, pretty dry, pretty dry. TUS means absolutely nothing. I just, I just want to see if it'll work, work, work. Um, it's either there or that's more of the original red color. Let me clean it off to see what happens. Of course, if you have to work this hard to get color on your stamps, you're probably not. It's probably not effect efficient. Let's put a different on a different one. This will be my tester thing. Yeah, so that's really light. There's not much there. So I'm going to put it as a fail. Another fail. Another fail. Another fail. Which is sad because I really wanted these colors to work for me. Okay, let's clean off our W. Remember, if I have to work this hard to get it to give me color, it's really not worth it. Not when, not when I could invest in a little bit more and buy some just ink pads. Because I bought, you know, the stuff to make the ink pads, to ink, make these ink pads, so. Um. Now, the food coloring was kind of off. So, what I'll probably do is try it again. We'll use just a dish pan, like you said. Um, and see what happens. And I'll probably put them in this glass things, because they seem like they work. Okay, so the green is there just a little bit. A little bit. The same as the pink is. Um... been about a month since I made them so all right let's try this next color even though it hasn't been a month since you watched all of the videos because I have you know spread them out this one's stuck they don't want to come up it's stuck on the <laughs> It's stuck on the thing. That is pretty dry. So brown is a no-go. In fact, it's so stuck on there, I gotta throw this one out. So that's, that's not gonna work. I gotta recycle it, though. So we'll stick that over there. And we will toss out that. Okay. I'm not even uh, coming back to it. It can come back. It can come back if I add color to it. It's not going to come back. Okay, so what color is this one? It seems really wet. Still. Well, no, maybe not. So they just dried out is what it seems like. Maybe because I needed to cover them closer. Well, there's a little bit of a, a little bit of a color to that one, but again, not in any shape or form that I'd want to use it. Um. Okay. And then there's this one. This is a blue. It's a 
it the same blue as that other big one. This one seems to have color in it. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that one seems to be have uh, some color in it. So that is a, but it says it's a blue and it's coming out of green. Has not a lot of color, but again, it's another one that has color. Okay, last two. Last two. Last two. This is a dish pad one, and it is dry, 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 it looks like. Yep, it is. It is dry. So, this is too much space, I'm thinking for them to stay not dry. So, that dried out. Dried out, dried out, dried out. Too bad, because I like the containers. Um, and the last one, of course, is this one, I think. That's the orange. Looks like it might be a little wet. Nope, there's nothing there either, so. Out of out of all of them, we got two that were wet and two that were still had something on. Three of them that had something on them, and that's it. So that's the uh, end result of my DIY, which is a big fat fail. Um, I might revisit again down the road. I got different food coloring. Um, maybe it's my hand sanitizer. I think that's what we used. I mean, maybe that's what it is. Maybe I should use something else to make it. Um, anyway, and then, like I said, if you're interested in how to make the book Rolodex, just go to Al John. Um, and uh, it's a recent one that she just made. It's really easy. You can watch her and do it while she's doing the video. And then you just decorate it yourself. So, all right. That's it. That's all of it. I'm out of here.